I'm George and this is going to be uh, accordion stradella basses and the circle of fifths and we know or are told that the accordion basses are set out in the circle of fifths and you get that crazy picture of the circle of fifths and you might learn it C G D A E B F sharp and so on or going the other way F B flat E flat um, or you can so, some people think of it as going towards the sharps and towards the flats so C has no sharps and flats C major scale and the G major scale has one sharp and the D major scale has two sharps and you can see there's a, a pattern there and so you can go up um, four buttons and you know it's going to be four sharps and, and, and four sharps is an E so and, and most accordions have a little blip on the E as well as one on the C so that, that's, that's my kind of I, I find my way around by that and then going downwards into the flats, F, B flat, E flat, A flat. Most, um, most accordions have a little blip on that one. Some have it on the E flat, which I prefer the A flat. And uh, so that gives you four flats down there. And of course, the whole thing's transposing, so it doesn't matter where you start, if you're going, if you're going up the interval is always going to be the same and this is the next thing I wanted to say is that if you go up two buttons it's two fifths which becomes a tone so let's just look at that this side C to G is a fifth G to D is a fifth and so two buttons up on an accordion to the low bass would be C to D and uh, you can go on round the tones like that and get a tone scale if you jump missing buttons. But this is where it gets interesting for me, I think, is, is um, all the white notes are together in the circle of fifths and all the ones with, with uh, sharps and flats are, are, are also bunched together. So seven white notes, five sharp and flat notes. And... The, if you take the first three um, tones like this, C, D, E, so that's take a button, miss a button if you like, towards the ceiling. Then the next four notes of the major scale, or the, the other four white notes, are interleaved with those three. So they're these two, the G and the A, which are uh, in between, and the F below and the B above. So you can, if you want, play a scale like this, not really recommended, so I'm just going C, D, E, which is C, miss a button, D, miss a button, E, drop my little finger down to an F, which is the one below C, and then just miss a button all the way up to the B and then come back to the C. So, but that's, for me, um, not a, a great way of playing a scale because there's a much better way of using the counter bass and uh, I've got videos about that. But, the, um, but it gives, it locates everything for me and I can see it in my mind with this uh, C, D, E or whatever, it doesn't matter that it's a C. It could be the, the, the tonic, the second and the third, and then you get the fourth, the fifth, the sixth, and the seventh. And that's how it is. C, C, D, E, F, G, A, B. Or whatever key you're in. Yeah, that's it. Circle of fifths, Stradella basses. Hope that made some sense. <laughs>